Welcome back to the Red Carpet Reup, your go-to source for the wildest moments in entertainment. Today, we're talking about something that had both fans and paparazzi cracking up. Kevin Hart's hilarious reaction when asked about Diddy and his alleged baby oil obsession. If you haven't heard about this one, you're in for a ride. Let's dive right in. So, recently a clip resurfaced from 2010 of Kevin Hart hosting a Diddy party for his last Train to Paris album release. Now, if you know Kevin Hart, you know he's got a quick wit and hilarious reactions. And this party was no exception, from pause moments to a girl's hair catching fire. Uh, I'm not jumping, I'm not jumping to myself, uh, you know, once, once everybody gets out, you know, just me and the lady. This is my scene. I'm used to this type of thing. Uh, you know, doing what I do best. Oh, oh, shit! Oh, did the camera catch that? Cut the camera! Yes, you heard that right. It was a wild night. But what really made headlines is what happened just recently when Kevin was casually heading to dinner with his wife, Eniku, in West Hollywood. A paparazzo decided to ask him a pretty bizarre question, straight up asking if he caught any baby oil while hosting Diddy's party. Yeah, baby oil. Kevin's reaction, classic. He wasn't having any of it. He dismissed the question real quick with, you asking the wrong person the wrong question, man. And when they tried to follow up asking if Diddy's safe in jail, Kevin stuck to his guns and repeated his line. Hey, Kevin, when you hosted for Diddy, did he catch any baby oil? Kevin, come here. Can you go get some girls so we can be in the bedroom with some girls? Let's get some girls up here, please. First and foremost, I'm not getting in the bed. You ask the wrong person the wrong question. That's not your question. Do you think he's safe in jail? Wrong person, wrong person. The reason keeping it cool but evasive. Now, if you're wondering why anyone would even bring up baby oil in the first place, it's tied to Diddy's last train to Paris party. Back in 2010, Kevin was hosting this live streamed event in a New York hotel room with Diddy. And let's just say some moments had the internet buzzing. At one point, Diddy asked Kevin to sit next to him on a bed. No homo, no, just, just don't get close to the bed. Don't get close to the bed, but it's just like, yo, we want to thank you for hosting the thing, man, man. It's been a pleasure. You didn't have to do it, you did it. No, 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 I definitely didn't have to do it. I, I definitely didn't have to. Uh, first and foremost, I'm not getting the bed. Uh, you know, shout out to him and what he did. I'm just gonna, if we can, just let's, let's just put the camera a little this way, just so we're not, I don't want my shot to even, like, I don't want it to come close to the bed at all. I, sh I should look like he fresh off a goddamn plane. I should, I should, I should. This my brother right here from day one. He used to wake up and, I mean, damn, pause, but like, just out. I mean, I mean, back in the days when he was like 10 and I was a little bit older, his older brother, we used to fight over the, over the frosted flakes, you know what I'm saying, before pause was invented. <laughs> but it's my brother for real. We used to actually wrestle off of the, off of the frosted place because he used to always get up early. And now he's one of the richest stars in the world. And I'm Yo, like, what the fuck did... Better not know. Leading to some pause-worthy reactions. And Diddy even shared a story about wrestling Usher over cereal when they lived together. Yeah, it was interesting. Fast forward to today, Diddy's in hot water with some serious legal allegations. He's facing charges of sex trafficking and coercing women into disturbing situations, with one of the most bizarre details being his supposed stash of over 1,000 bottles of baby oil. Prosecutors claim Diddy used it during these alleged freak-off parties. His lawyer tried to explain it away by saying Diddy buys in bulk, like it's some Costco run. But Costco came out and said they don't even stock baby oil. I mean, this just gets weirder by the minute. So while Kevin Hart might have dodged that paparazzi question with a laugh, it's clear that Diddy's situation is no laughing matter. The legal case is ongoing, and only time will tell what happens next. But for now, we've got Kevin Hart's quick wit to lighten the mood, even in the strangest of situations. Thanks for tuning in to the Red Carpet Reup. Be sure to hit that like button, subscribe for more entertainment updates, and let us know in the comments. What do you think about Kevin Hart's reaction? See you next time.